my god, look at this! So I've been picking up donations for many, many years. I have barrels in a couple of different pet stores in the city. And since we're getting ready to move to Texas, I'm actually getting one of the founders of the rescue that I take all these donations to. So we're gonna go today and I'm just gonna introduce her to the staff at the store and she's gonna take over the barrel and we're gonna pick up donations. And I've actually been saving up all of these donations to give to Elsa as well. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take them today too. We'll be back in a little bit, okay? I gotta meet Elsa at 5.30, so unfortunately we're gonna hit traffic, so we gotta get going. <laughs>
picking up donations from Cahoots uh, to help uh, Dog Rescue Without Borders rescue dogs and cats. If you would like to donate, there's going to be a link in the description so that you can support Dog Rescue Dog Borders. It's chilly, chilly outside. <laughs> All right, guys, we just loaded everything into Elsa's car. Back in my car now, getting out of the cold. It's actually quite chilly here in San Diego today. We're getting into the cold months. All right, guys, question of the video. What do you think about rescue dogs? Do you have a rescue dog maybe? Or have you ever rescued a dog? Are you looking to rescue a dog? Let me know what your thoughts are. Um, especially if you do have a rescue dog. I would love to hear about it. Post below in the comments so we can get a conversation going. But we had a really good um, haul today. There was lots and lots of food, like big unopened bags of food, which was, it's great because that's what the rescues need generally more than anything is food to feed the animals. And yeah, so Elsa's gonna be taking over the donation bin here since we're moving in a couple of months. I just wanted to kind of get a head start on that to make sure everything goes smoothly and make sure the animals are getting everything that's being donated to them. I really appreciate you guys watching this video. Thank you so much for taking your time out and definitely make sure to check the links in the description because I have linked to the Dog Rescue Without Borders website. So if you want, if you're in the area and you're looking to adopt a dog, definitely check them out. Or if you just want to make a donation, I mean, every dollar counts. So check the link in the description to do that. And thank you for doing that. Also make sure to give this video a thumbs up. And if you look down there at that subscribe button, if it's red, go ahead and click it and turn it gray. When that happens, a bell will appear, click the bell, select all notifications. That way YouTube can actually notify you every time I post a new video. Also check the other links in the description, especially the first link to Patreon. Make sure you join me over on Patreon because you get all new and exclusive content over there. We can actually chat back and forth and have discussions um, about anything with your pets, right? Dog behavior, dog training, uh, positive training, of course, uh, canine nutrition, cat nutrition, cat enrichment, dog enrichment, all of that good stuff. We can have conversations over there. So make sure to join me over on Patreon. Again, thank you so much for being here with me today. I can't wait to see you in the next video. Hey guys, just a quick footnote. The terms Humane Society and SPCA are generic. Shelters using those names are not part of the ASPCA. You need to know this. The Humane Society of the United States currently, no government institution or animal organization is responsible for tabulating national statistics for animal protection movement. These are national estimates. The figures may vary from state to state, but I will tell you that approximately six and a half million companion animals enter the U.S. shelters nationwide every year. Of those, 3.3 million are dogs and 3.2 million are cats. We estimate the number of dogs and cats entering U.S. shelters annually has declined from approximately 7.2 million in 2011. The biggest decline was in dogs from 3.9 million to 3.2 million. You guys are doing your part. Each year, approximately 1.5 million shelter dogs are euthanized though, and 670,000 dogs and 860,000 cats. The number of dogs and cats euthanized in U.S. shelters annually has declined from approximately 2.6 million in 2011. That's the good thing, but there's still a lot more work to be done. Approximately 3.2 million shelter animals are adopted each year, 1.6 million dogs and 1.6 million cats. And it's estimated that 78 million dogs and 85.8 .8 million cats are owned in the United States. Approximately 44% of all households in the United States have a dog and 35% have a cat. The source is the American Pet Products Association from 2015 to 2016. But please do your part. Approximately 40% of all dog owners and 46% of all cat owners learn about their pet through word of mouth. Do your part and adopt. Thanks for watching this video.